Phil Lightfoot. I'm a teaching fellow here. What that means is that I'm a, a teaching specialist, if you like. Uh, so I'm dedicated to teaching. I don't do any research within this department. Uh, I'm in charge of five different courses. I've got um, jobs within most of the labs. Uh, I'm in charge of graduate training. I'm in charge of the allocation of the postgrads to teaching within the department and also in charge of careers uh, within the department as well. So uh, the teaching program, essentially it's based around lectures. Uh, to complement the lectures, we have problem classes. And inside the problem classes, the students will work through a sequence of, of questions. And they'll get support from a, a postgrad and also a member of staff. They'll also have tutorials in the first and the second years. Uh, and in inside those tutorials, they'll have an opportunity to discuss problems with the course, see the course in a, a wider context, for example, research in the department, and also possible careers and applications in the general community. In terms of the, the size of the, 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 the lecture courses, of course, sometimes the, the core material is given to, to cohorts of the size 150 students, for example. Uh, you can have, in the, the later years, years three and four, you can have much smaller groups as they come to specialise in specific areas of physics. As far as the tutorials go, we have usually around about six students in a tutorial group, problem classes around about 30 students in a tutorial group. Uh, and in labs, of course, depends on the, the program that the student has gone into, but that can be anything between 80 students for an experimental group to 30 for astrophysics or theoretical physics.